Admission and Matriculation Board, JAMB, has labelled the recently concluded Unified Tertiary Examination as a groundbreaking milestone in examination history. While addressing the media at the JAMB National Headquarters, Registrar Professor Ishak Oloyede highlighted the examination's unprecedented innovation and emphasised a notable decrease in instances of misconduct. Professor Oloyede expressed appreciation and praised the examination's novel approaches on the scoring its efficiency in curbing malpractice. He commended the efforts of both administrators and examinees in upholding the integrity of the assessment process. Our correspondent Edith Yomibanga has details. There are laws in this country. If a staggering 1.9 million candidates enrolled for the 2024 Unified Tertiary Matriculation Examination across 700 computer-based test centers in Nigeria in the just-concluded UTM examination. The JAM Registrar Professor Oloyode, while speaking to newsmen, disclosed that the board has achieved a milestone with the enrollment of over a million female candidates as well as persons living with disabilities. In 2024, we have 49.4% of male and 50.6% of female. That is, of the figure that I have earlier on told you, 1,989,668, 1 million and 7,275 were female, and the male less than 1 million. And this is an improvement on female participation in 2023 was 49.7. In 2022 was 48.4, so there is growth. He said the board witnessed a near zero infraction in examination misconduct as cases recorded were of impersonation and smuggling of devices. Despite all efforts, it is disturbing that some unscrupulous CBT centers still conspired with some parents, tutorial classes, and colleges to arrange for multiple fingers for single registration to allow professional examination takers to gain access to the examination hall. You have the celebrated, the inglorious one of even a father having to put his finger in the registration of the child to be able to gain access to the examination hall. Of course, the good news is that many of them are either in the net or are being tracked presently. The registrar appealed to parents to desist from interfering in their awards choice and identify Jem as a worthy partner in molding them. Edith Young Ibanga, ADBN News.